Yeah. Um, yeah. Dominated. All right. Yes. Yeah, so, can you talk us through the goals? Well, to be fair, I can't. To be fair, that first one, brilliant finish. Uh, uh, second one, unreal. Uh, good things. Good things are happening now. Good things. Oh, that's great. Yeah. So, w were you expecting a win against Rotherham? Yeah. Yeah. We had a bad, bad form, but you know. I thought if we're, gonna, if we're gonna win a game, it'll be against rivals. All right. Did, did some people think that um, Rotherham was gonna do you today because they, they had a rest, didn't they? When, when yeah, they, when yeah. They yeah, they've had a rest, but uh, you know they've, they've had a few injuries. Uh, but you know, I think we deserve to win. All right. So have you been a Wednesday fan most of your life? Yeah, all my life. Yeah, all my life. Generations oh. and generations. All right. And do you go to most home games? Yeah, as, as many as I can. I've got a season ticket, but uh, I've got, I'm a footballer myself, so I try oh. to balance it, you know. Oh, right, uh, yeah, Get yeah. to as many as I can, but I've got a season ticket. Well, so can you tell us uh, what 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 uh, local league you play for then? Oh, so I'm a, I'm a footballer in uh, the local uh, Medwall League, uh, Division B. I play for a team called Momo Juniors. I also play for my college as well. But tomorrow I've got English Colleges Trials. Uh, oh right, yes, yeah, so give them a shout, yeah. That's uh, a, yeah, because that's the, the grassroots of football. It's what keeps the game alive, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's, it's brilliant. Uh, yeah, so, so tell us what, what position do you play then? So I, I'm a goalkeeper. Oh, goalie? Yeah, I'm a goalkeeper. All oh, right, yeah. so what do you think of the uh, Rotherham goalkeeper today? A bit questionable. He spilled a lot of, spilled a lot of goals. Uh, his positioning weren't the best, but I know he is a very good keeper. He's a very good keeper. He just had a bad day? Yeah, it's a bad day, I think. I, I, I know personally, I do, I do look up to your answer to be fair, he's a very good keeper. For his height as well, he manages it very well. Could you tell us about the Sheffield Wednesday goalie, is he, is he good? Cameron Dawson, he's, he's a local lad and you know, he's come up through our academy so he's, you know, I know he's a good keeper but I feel like it's a confidence thing. Um, I feel like his, his positioning, he needs to he needs to commit. He always thinks twice when he's making his decisions. It's like coming off line and stuff like that. He'll always back off or he needs to be 100% in what he's doing because that's how mistakes happen. All oh, right, yeah, OK. And, and, and um, Chef Wednesday fans in general, they're, they're happy with the manager? Oh, yeah, we're buzzing. This is the most positivity I've seen in years, to be fair. Um, yes. We're very happy. We've got a very good coach and stuff as well. Yeah, any news about... Um, a new buyer? Is, are the fans happy with the owner? Uh, you see, we've just got under an embargo for not paying to HMRC. Um, now it, it, it's one of them. He, he has always tried to, you know, fiddle with uh, payments and stuff like that, trying to find ways around, you know, paying to government and you know, paying fees and stuff like that. Um, I feel like it has. I feel like it's very bad timing for an embargo to happen because you know we've, we've had a bad manager, you know, new managers come in, he's unreal, and then we've kind of had this, you know, big embargo put on us. It's kind of bad timing. Yeah, could you tell us a bit more details about this embargo? Uh, yeah, so basically it stops us from adding any players to our squad list, uh, which is sort of bad timing. Luckily, we've just managed to get Marvin Johnson onto it, so that's a positive. But yeah, it is very bad timing. It oh, basically stops us from transfers, stuff like that. But I think it'll be paid off. I think it's one of them where not everyone likes paying to HMRC. Um, so yeah, so you've avoided any points deductions or anything like that? We don't know yet. Uh, I feel like it's very early days. I feel like the longer it goes on without paying, you know, there might be, there might be more detail into it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's one of those things. Well, thank you very much for that, for that detailed uh, insight. Right, yeah.